All right, this is how to find studs in the wall. All right, every stud from the corner of the room, find the corner of the room, and usually the studs are every 16 inches. So it'll be like stud and stud, every 16 inches spaced. Um, some places, like mine, it would be 24 inch spaced studs. All right, so just to show you, you can see, right, you can see that, like right here, 24 inch, right here, see? Now, what you want to do is get a stud finder or measuring tape. You go to measure it, um, you can find a stud in three different ways, or actually four different ways. One is with the measuring tape, if you know it's 16 inch space studs. Another is, um, Actually, you can knock, there's five ways. You can knock, sometimes some people hear it, it sounds different. Uh, you can hear uh, kind of like an echo, that's obviously not a stud. If you don't hear echo, then that's a stud. Um, if you find an electrical socket, like right here, on the left or right side will be a stud running along that, most cases. Electricians usually like to mount their uh, electrical receptacles there. So, you can also buy this for five bucks. This is uh, called a magnetic stud finder. Basically, it's a heavy duty magnet and it grabs onto the drywall nails in the wall. And the drywall nails will only be where the studs are because that's how the builders put up the drywall and they mount the drywall to the studs to keep the drywall up. So, that would. Uh, See? And there you go. So that's actually the center of the stud. So this is actually more accurate than most stud finders and you don't have to replace the batteries. And you can drop it and it won't break. So you mark it right there, put the screw right dead on, right where the, the line is, and you be pretty much dead on. With the electronic one, it's a little trickier because you have to find the left side of the stud and the right side of the stud. This one, and then you find that side, and then you find that side. So you mark right here, you mark right here, but it's not always 100% accurate. So you know the stud is this wide. So once you go this side, and it beeps, you mark it, and then you slide it across, and it beeps, and then you mark it. So you know the stud is that thick and that wide. So you want to go in between the that. So between that line and line, line, that line, halfway point, put X, screw right into, it, into there. Me, I use this all day long. And it's a lot faster and it's always accurate. See? And it's in the middle, see? I don't know if you can see that, but. I'm recording in HD, so I don't know if you guys can see that resolution. So use this if you're doing an installation. And if there's no studs in the wall, you can use these drywall anchors. They made, uh, Todd Valer makes them. They hold up 238 pounds, 238 pounds in half inch drywall. And excellent, I use those all day long. Enjoy, thanks for watching, subscribe and like.